Hello everyone, and welcome back to Her Story. Alright, so, I did a little bit of digging. Um, I didn't look up, like, any spoilers for myself or anything. Um, but I did discover that there is, like, an achievement for finishing the game, quote-unquote. And I literally can do it right now. If I go to Chit Chat, call them, and say that I'm done. And then, that basically ends the game. Um... And so, and I don't know what happens, I'm not really certain. I think I'm gonna dig a little deeper. I think this might be the last episode then. Um, yeah, because I think, um, yeah, I think this is just gonna be the last episode and then all of, like all of the other achievements and stuff and whatever, I'll probably just find on my own time. I mean, we got a huge dip into the story and I, and I want everyone else to play this game. This is a fantastic game to just, really play and just respond to because like wow every like those certain videos that were like holy shit like I can't believe this is what happened kind of thing like just like the really really unique narrative structure here is fantastic and I love it um, this is a definite like 8 out of 10 probably 9 out of 10 closer like just for what it is like I'd probably give, like, I've never played the original, not the original, um, the 2016 Doom, like, the remake, I suppose, I suppose, um, but, like, I'd probably give that, like, a 9, probably almost a 10, like, and I'm not, and I'm not gonna say, like, this is on par with Doom, like, the different games and different genres, for what this game is, this is fantastic, like, it's definitely, like, an 8 or a 9. So, just to give it, like, a score rating right now, maybe it'll, I'll give it an 8.5, because that's, that's journalism, but, anyway, so, we're gonna dig a little deeper, I'm gonna just throw in a couple keywords to see if I can get any farther, dig any more, because, wow, yeah, I just, boy oh boy, I found a really cheeky, someone had a really cheeky, uh, cheeky, uh, um, strategy. It's literally you search blank and then, yeah, what it does is it finds all of the finds all, like, you know when you have the user tag. You have the user tags there, and so they start as blank. And so then you search blank and it finds all of these. So then, what you can do is you watch every all of the five videos there, and in the user tag, you change, after you watch them, you change the user tag from blank to just like, I don't know, put a period in there, or something else. If it, and then, research blank, and those videos disappear to be replaced by five new ones. And there you go. There you go. You've pretty much figured out the most, the cheekiest way to look at all of the videos. And... Like that's almost cheating. I'm absolutely, absolutely fucking literally not gonna do that. Not even. I'm not even gonna look. Look at this guy. Well, it's seven seconds. I'll look at this guy. It's not a big deal. Black coffee, thanks. No sugar. Sweet enough as it is. Oh ha 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 ha. But uh, that does correlate to. Um, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna talk about these. Um, these words. Well, could be one that I looked up. Um, so I don't think, oh, I'll leave this one too, because I don't think, uh, did I even do that one? Uh, maybe not. So this might be a shorter one, it's probably just going to be the ending. Um, just a little more digging, then get the ending out of the way, and that will probably be it. So we're going to start with a wig. There's a few mentions. There we go. We've got seven. So there's no real ending besides logging off and, like, logging off a good with the chit-chat thing. So let's let's take a peek. Take a peek, see here. Right, six seconds. The wig? You mean... What type of wig? Yeah, you're, you're nervous. As soon as they mention the wig, it's like... Yeah, I've never worn a wig. What kind of wig? Yeah, you're very, like... You're very adamant to finding out, like, what kind of wig. 
this other person doesn't exist. I don't know what the blonde wig is, but it could be anything. Have you looked at the cat flap? Hmm. You're suspicious. It was nine that night. I went round and she was waiting for me. She was furious and so angry. The kind of anger you can only have towards yourself. We screamed at each other, argued, cried, we fought. I hit her back, left a bruise. Oh. I had my wig on from performing and she tore it off. Eventually, we grew tired of fighting and I left. Okay. Was that 9 or is it 9 p.m. and 9 years? Oh, it's gotta be 9 p.m. So that bruise could have been from. Not from Simon hitting her, but from Eve hitting her. Either way, she'd wanna hide it. But still. Okay, we've got five for coffee. Mm. Back it is back. It was a present to myself. I shouldn't even be drinking coffee with the baby. It's been hard trying to give it up. I think they to have one cup. Oof. That's why you don't drink coffee, ladies and gentlemen. Never depend on fucking filling your body with caffeine to get you away, because you're going to fucking crash. Anyway. Coffee, I guess. Milk and sugar. Now I'm going to do milk, because fuck you. Okay. Ba -ba -ba. So coffee. Now we got. I'm gonna just do sweet. Yeah, there's nothing. Sugar. There's some mentions with coffee. Sugar. God, I wonder if we're gonna find out who the fuck I'm like playing right now. I still don't. Just the one sugar. Thanks. Is that kind of recording? Of fucking course it is. You're at an interview, they always record your shit. I'm gonna look up camera. Got a fucking interview. You think you're not being recorded? I'm um, fucking black police station. Sugar. Thanks. That's what a lot of coffee. I don't know uh, exactly. Uh, I feel like I probably looked at this. Yeah, nothing for that. I don't think they ever say the word disguise. I was just a, uh, just a uh, throwing it out there. I don't even. I don't think I've looked up window either. Probably have. No, I have not. That's five. Perfect. Let's take a peek, seats. No, they were shut. Most of the windows are really hard to open anyway. It's stifling in summer. They were painted over by my dad. Could have left a door open accidentally. Oh. There's a cat flap in the back door. I mentioned the cat flap a lot. I guess it was a cat. I don't remember you guys mentioning a cat ever. Um, so. Okay, yeah, up in there. Look at T now. Oh, not Tess. T. Oh, six. A few seconds there. Um, could I have a cup of tea? No, because, uh, fuck you. Another few seconds. Maybe a fresh cup of tea? Well, those are helpful. Always happy to get totally helpful ones. Camera. Ooh, third one.
Is that camera recording? Do you ask that every single time? What about you? What did you mention about no, the camera? No, he doesn't have any tattoos. He has a scar. Oh, we, that was like one of the first videos after we looked at this session. Alright, so let's look at the cat. Ooh, five. Okay. Got the cat. No, no cat. My parents had a cat before they died called Domino. It's this mm. little black thing with white dots. Well, oh, there we go. I never did anything about the cat that way. If you were thin, you could maybe squeeze through it. Hmm. I don't know. When we went together, we'd send secret messages by tapping out a code that we'd learn from the book. The knock code. Something prisoners of war would use. Oh, <laughs> I think I've heard We'd tap them out on radiator pipes or the attic floor. Okay, I'm probably going to look up knock code at some point. Uh, should I add a session? So that's, yeah, that's what that is. Um, let's look at the. Is it you? No. This one. Here we go.
one second here. Okay. Well, that's... That's really interesting. So what is this? Okay, so... Whew, okay, that's... Wow, alright. So, really interesting actually. So right here, this one, I'll, I'll play that out here. That, that, that whole thing, that's three, one, three, four, five, one, one, five, four, five. So if you group those up into groups of two, so three, one, three, four, five, one, one, five, four, five. Um, each of those corresponds to, I'll probably put the, I'll put the graph up. The, it's called the Roman alphabet tap code, um, because C and K are combined into this, to, so there's 25 squares. Um, but she, with that, spells out L O V E U, love you. Which, when I figured that out, that was, I that actually sent a bit of a chill up my spine because, whew. And that video, she was pretty much communicating to Eve. Um, and I think she was just, she was just speaking to herself, thinking there was no one who could hear her. Because then, you know, the guy walks in and she, like, Get to pick yourself back up and everything. But this one, I'll play it again. Play it for you. So that, I think there's a bit of a mistake on her part, um, because that spelled, um, it was, that code was 1, 2, 5, 4, 1, 4, 2, 3, 1, 1, 3, 3, 3, 3, 1, 1, 3, 3. And I think there was a bit of a mistake. Um, I feel like that should have been, um, and right there that's, how many groupings is that? Nine. So there's nine letters. Uh, there's 18 tap, uh, tap groups of up to five. And so there's 18 times she tapped something out. Um, so groups of so groups of two. So there were nine letters in that. Um, and so I'm pretty sure that the third the third letter is um, that was tapped out as one four. I'm pretty sure that was supposed to be one five, and then the last grouping was three three, and I'm pretty sure that was supposed to be two three, um, because then that would have spelled out by Hannah. So, because otherwise it spells B Y D H A N N A N. So, and that doesn't really be bid Hanan. I don't, I don't think so. I think she made a mistake, and I think that was supposed to say, by Hannah. So. Whew! Wow. That's... That's almost, that's almost a little spooky to figure that out, like, just to see that. So, let's keep going. Yeah, cat. Domino. And he had this little bell around his neck to stop him from killing birds in the garden. Mm -hmm. We used to write each other notes, put them in the bell, and we could send them to each other. Mum found some of the notes once and she thought I was just writing to myself because our handwriting was identical. And we had our own words for things, so she didn't quite understand them anyway. <laughs> alright, alright. Well, that's something. So that's cat. Um, let's see. So we've only got three more, and I'm going to keep going until we kind of run out of uh so yeah flap is 
All old, old news there. So I'm gonna keep going until I run out of leads, and then I'm gonna say I'm done. And hopefully that doesn't like completely delete this game, like the file, and doesn't force me to start new, because that would really suck. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Whew. Interesting. So we got flap. That's nothing. And then we have bell. That's two point five seconds. Okay, you got me. I'll confess. We were there. It was a dirty weekend. Simon was going to expense it. Pretend it was a business trip. I used a made-up name. We stayed at the hotel. Had room service. Didn't leave the room. Had a great view of the river. And you could hear the church bells. Like you said, we were very romantic. Oof, I almost got slightly excited. Thinking that we almost got a confession, but nope. That's fine. Got a couple of... Please learn to spell. Holy shit. Okay. So, on to notes, or at least just note. I'm sure. Okay, oh, yeah, it's one. It's nothing. Ooh, excuse me. I'm not burping. I haven't eaten anything recently. Um, so, we're going to look at church. I don't know if we've already done that. No, we haven't. we got three there. What do you got? Let me see. Yes. I drove in here, because I remember well, I went over the river, and then there was a church. There. Yeah. And I probably part well, I remember seeing a street sign called Princess Street. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure it must be this one. There. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Both of those are out. Still got three more that I'm just adding on. We're being quick so far, so nothing nothing big. That was nothing. Street's gonna be a really weird one. I'm sure it's gonna fucking two trillion. Oh, there's eight. And uh, another menu. Excellent. Okay, and then last one. Prince. Ah! New one. Five. Look at princess as well. Equality. Eleven seconds. I don't know if anyone really changes. You just become more. <coughs> Jesus, I'm sorry. Simon was my prince. And that hasn't changed. Ah. So I, I, th I think that did change. Well, maybe, maybe not. But you sure made a fucking mistake, I'll tell you that. Alright, so there's seven. I feel like we probably looked up Princess at some point. Uh, I guess not. Alright, well. Oh, there was one more thing. In true spirit, and I think that just... Yeah, I think that literally just filled up my last, my last little thing, the space I had there. In true spirit of this channel, hell yeah. Dropping the f bomb. And it actually worked. Like holy shit. It actually worked because I got fucking five hits. Three of them are new. Uh, ah, stop. 
just done with that one because yes. whatever. I'll speak for Bella at least once a day. Not that there's anything much to say. It's more <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Thank you. Oh, I think, I think, did we do Eleanor? I think we did Eleanor. I'm pretty sure we did Eleanor at one point. As Simon, Simon's mom? Yeah, Simon's mom. So, well, you got an achievement out of that. Perfectly fine. Oh, and then. No, yeah. I'm okay. That's not how it works, lady. <laughs> you can't just fucking leave like that. You're not allowed to just fucking be like, are you arresting me? Well then fuck you, goodbye. Ah, <sighs> okay. Well, let's take a final look. I don't know what the volume missing thing is. I hope that's not like a... Uh, I hope that's not like a th whatever it is, like the, the end game thing. That really upset me. But... Well, I think we did pretty good. I think we did pretty good. Um, I'm gonna leave it at that. We're gonna watch the ending, of course, but, uh, you know. That, that looked pretty good. That looked pretty mopped up. I mean, I'm, certainly there's gaps, but I think we had a really good... I think we really picked this apart. But you know what? Yes, we're going to be done. Oh. Oh. Simon and Hannah's kid. Jesus. <sighs> yeah. I understand why. And of course, I don't agree with it, but I understand. Sarah. <sighs> My name's Sarah. I want to know who the fucking actors were. I hope I didn't miss them. <sighs> Jesus Christ. So it didn't even... I wasn't there looking f to, like, prove anything, which makes... I, I suppose that should make sense. Like, what am I... I don't know. I did not... I did not see my character as female. I'll be perfectly honest. I 
did not. Like, just seeing the face structure, I didn't see it. I was pretty certain it was relatively... was pretty... It looked pretty male to me. But, I mean, whatever. There's some masculine-looking females out there. I'm not gonna judge. I'm not gonna say anything wrong. Like, eh, you're not really a female because you don't look like a female. It's like, fuck off. But, like, I, I didn't see that coming. Not like that was the biggest... Like, oh my gosh, the female? Like, like that's not... That's, that's not, like, really a twist. Knowing the name... And that it was that she was looking at tapes of her mother was like as big of a like was the biggest thing. So like that was a bigger thing to me than learning she was a female. But holy shit, dude! Wow, that's a lot of pre-orders. Like this whole list, I'm ninety-nine percent sure is all pre-orders. I don't think there was another category. Like, I don't think that's a special thanks or anything. I think they already had that. Oof, duh. Oh, hey. What was it? Admin unlock. Hey, okay. So I can, I can still go in with continue. I'm... <sighs> wow. Just wow. That was... That was pretty epic, if I have to say. <laughs> Jesus. But wow, that... That... That was... That was really nice. That was just... That was just a really nice game. Like... <sighs> that was incredible. I... I can't put into words just... Like, I don't... I wouldn't say this is meaningful to me. Like, this isn't going to be, like, a fond memory or anything like that. But, like, that's that was just... Just from a gameplay standpoint and a storytelling standpoint. Like, that... That was just really nice. Like, that was... If... If this ended up changing, like, how narrative driven stories in games were told like I would not be surprised in the slightest I think this won awards at the video game awards which it deserves if, like it deserves the narrative like narrative awards or storytelling or whatever um, gameplay innovation maybe I don't know if there's been other stories like this maybe I wouldn't be too surprised because like it, it was really simple. It was a really simple, like, gameplay concept. It was literally... It, it was, like, simple but complex at the same time and like, the scope, I suppose. Because you're... Like, it puts in murder. You already have the videos for, like, murder. And you get, like, the situation put in front of you of, like... Um... Of, like, hey, this woman's husband was murdered. And you get to, like, dig into more of that and... Like, either you determine who the murderer was, or, um, whether, like, who, like, who was charged with, like, discovering just, or just learning the story. Like, as we discovered, we already found out, like, her mom was charged, and, like, of course we're looking at only, like, snippets of the, uh, um, of, like, the, of, like, the interviews and everything. So, I can't imagine that it's, like... So, it was clear that, at the end, you know, they already, like, the interviewers already discovered that by talking with Hannah and Eve, that they discovered that, you know, Hannah was the one who ended up killing the husband. It, it was an accident, but, like, she wasn't intending to kill Simon. But, you know, it was, it, it happened, and you had to pay the price for that. So, like, everyone, like, no one was... I mean, I suppose Eve is kind of like... I don't really know exactly the role Eve had in all of this. Like, maybe it was just... It ended up being like a... Um... Like, just a situation of... I don't know if Eve was flirting with him at one point. I think maybe that got brought up. That maybe Simon was getting flirty with her as well. 
and then discovered that, you know, they're two different people, and then was like, you know, I actually kind of like Eve more, I, I, I don't know what that would be about, like, I don't know how, like, I mean, I suppose if you like one, you probably like the other, if they're switching places and whatnot, but, like, wow, that was just... That was really nice. I'm gonna look at the credits again. I think I missed two of the fucking, uh... The voice... The voice actor. Who the actual actor was. Starring Viva. Viva Seifert. Viva, you did a fantastic job playing both characters. That was... That was fantastic. Way to go. Props to you for being able to just play a fucking two completely separate characters so well. Like, like there was, they were different, but similar enough where you could tell, like, like, hey, they're twins, and they look, they look like twins, and they act like twins, they act very similarly, um, but, like, and sometimes it was, it was really hard for me to tell them apart. I had to look at the, uh, I had to rely on the rooms to be like, okay, this looks this is Eve, or this is Hannah. Um, and so, so you did a really fantastic job. Please keep doing work. Like, goodness, that was fantastic. Um, but yeah, this game was like, it was, it was like really, I think I was talking about like, the game, how the gameplay concept probably isn't new, but like, this did it really well if it's not new. Because I have no idea. I haven't looked at every single game in existence to determine if this is new or not. Um, but this did a really great job with the concept if it's not the... if it didn't create it. The idea of literally all you're doing is you're at a computer, you're typing in keywords to find videos to lead you to new keywords to learn more and more about the story of these two people and their history together and just the lives of them and the people around them and to the point where you get a fully fleshed out story and you're kind of able to determine like, hey, um, like, hey, I know why my, who turned out to be my mother ended up killing my father. And, like, wow, that's... And the thing is, is like, there's a couple moments where, um, um, like, I wasn't 100% certain if, um, like, uh, like, which, if it was exactly truthful, if I was just getting, like, like, a piece of something that I wasn't, I wasn't getting, like, the full context of something, so I had to, like, sit there for a moment and kind of be like, is this exactly how it is, how it says, and then... Oh, excuse me. And then, by looking through a few other, um, a few other, like, pieces of the story, of a few other videos, and a couple of the, finding a couple of the pieces, determining that, yes, this is exactly how it is, and being like, oh my god, like, just, like, just being, I, just, the way some of these stories went was just really bizarre and interesting. I, it was just really nice. Like, it was such nice storytelling. And it's just really weird the kind of agency you have, too, because not every single person's story is gonna be the same. Like, her story is almost like... It's not just her story. It's literally her story as told by you, the player told by you to yourself and like I suppose to yourself and anyone else who watches like your video on this um cause uniquely enough you become the storyteller of her story like you tell the story in a different way based off of the keywords that you attach to and the videos that you see in the order of like just like the order of um, like these things that you look into 
and it's like every single person has a different could have almost a different take on it until you get all the pieces together and everything becomes clear. Just, just weird, but really cool, like really unique, just a really unique idea, and I just, gosh, I, I just can't even, like, comprehend just, well, I can comprehend, that's a silly thing to say, but just thinking about it, it's so weird, and like, almost beyond me, like, I'm sure there's so many pieces of, like, depth that I'm missing to this game, and it's, gosh, it's just, that is really strange. Again, I really just recommend that you play this. I know that, I, I know that, you know, if you watch, if you watch this, you kind of had a little bit of a spoil, but of course, there's a ton of videos that I didn't see, um, and, you know, it might be a different experience for you, you never know. Like, I hope that, like, I don't know, I really hope that in my first episode that I told you to play this game and buy this game, because you should before continuing, um, and I hope, I hope I said that right off the gate, because... Jeez, you really should. Maybe maybe in the editing I'll put a little thing of like maybe a little intro or something like if you have not played this game, play it and then see how like I do. Or like see my reaction or gameplay or whatever. Um, or if you don't wanna play it and you just wanna experience it together, I mean that's fine too. But I like at least at least give them your money. You don't have to play this game, but like buy the game even on sale. Like, just give them that number of how many people bought this game and were interested in it. Just, like, even if they probably, they probably have, I'm not going to say they have enough money, because I think this was an indie studio, and I think they need as much fucking money as they want if they're putting out quality, quality content. Um, and so, yeah, just, whew, that was, that was just really incredible. I'm, I'm really glad I played that. That was really nice. And so, I'm probably going to play this for a little while. I might try to 100% it. Um, uh, I might look at a couple guides just to get all the achievements by this point. How many, how many achievements? Sarah has logged off and crossed the road. Ah, that's nice. Do I have any, like, achievements that are... I do have a one hidden achievement. Hmm. I don't know what that could be. Hmm. Yeah. Detective Sergeant. Well, that's... That's just really interesting. I might have to look on, like, I saw that who is who spoiler thing. I mean, I've already kind of... I've already, it's already been already been spoiled by my own hand, so I've already I've already discovered as pretty much everything that I need to. So maybe that who is who will give like a comprehensive like this is the exact story of everything. So I'll look at that. Maybe it'll give, maybe it'll give me a new idea of like just exactly what the hell's going on of like exactly what happened and everything. But really, just. Fantastic game. I definitely, definitely really appreciate it from a storytelling standpoint. Um, and it's it's pretty up there. It is pretty up there. I don't want to say it's my favorite game. Um, I mean, I don't know. I have probably have quite a few games that are my favorite games that aren't good. But um, definitely, definitely a high quality game. I can say that. Definitely a lot of effort put into this really good effort put into the story, into the way it's, t the s way the story is told, the acting, that's really good, um, just, I've just, the music too, the music was just fantastic, I just was really, like, the music was just really good at setting the tone and kind of, like, the way a video would end, and then you'd have, like, a couple seconds of silence before the music would well up to, like, kind of reflect on that just 
really good. Just really good. F fantastic. So. Whew, that's going to have to be the end of that. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to be probably closing the game, just stopping all the recordings. But I'm probably going to hop back in and just keep playing. Maybe go for all the achievements and just, just let that be that. So thanks so much for watching. Thank you for going on this journey with me to play this game. Um, fantastic again. Once one more time. Really enjoyed it. Um, and I absolutely recommend everyone goes out to play it, or at least buy it and give the developer your money, and just let them know that hey, you put out some really good work, and you deserve like whatever money I send your way. So thanks again, and we'll see you next time in whatever game I just. I look into playing next. Have no idea. I, I really, I really want to play XCOM, but I really don't want to play XCOM. I really don't, because that's gonna give me an anxiety attack all the time. And so, I don't know. We'll see. I guess we'll see. But next, but anyway. Again, I always do this thing, like, it runs my family, I do it, I do my outro like four fucking times. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, 